It's me, your girl, Miss Candy Marie, and they got me cutting up here again today on the red carpet for Survivors and Morris. Listen, y'all, it got serious. We were literally battling out to get these interviews, so you know it's about to get real when we check out this show. All right, so let's get in there. We gotta go. How you doing? I'm Ron Rico Lee here at the screening premiere for Survivors and Morris season two, and you're tuning in to Sweet Candor TV. <laughs> We're here with Mike Epps at the red carpet premiere for Survivor's Remorse, and congratulations for making it past season one. How do you feel about season two? Well, you know season two is, is going to be a real, real good season because people are going to get a chance to come back and see the things that they missed in the first season. The first season was an introduction of what this television show is. So as the season grows, you get a chance to see the, the, the stories get better. The writing gets better. Everything gets better. And one last thing, Sweet Kindred TV is a positive media uh, outlet. So, you know, any words of encouragement that you can give our audience, our viewers, you know, just kind of telling them about what they can do to follow their dreams. Yeah, you know, always pursue your dreams. And always remember, man, you know, life is short. Take a chance, whatever chance you got to take to make it big in your life. Thank you so much. All right, I'm on the carpet right now with the very handsome Mr. Jacob Latimer. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good. So how excited are you about season two of Survivor's Remorse? Oh, uh, man, I'm super excited. You know, um, it's just a great cast, such a funny cast, energetic cast. All right, all right. One last thing. Uh, Sweet Kinder TV is a positive media platform. And, you know, there are some people that yeah, think that there isn't a need for positive media or that it's lame and, you know, all that other stuff. What's your take on that? Yeah, I think I, I probably deal with that the most. You know, I'm, I'm always, like, super positive. My, my image has always been clean. Everything's really, nobody has dirt on me, you know what I mean? Like, or like, nothing's been crazy on the media about me or anything like that. So sometimes people can take that as, like, lame. He's not edgy enough. He doesn't have enough fun, blah, 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 blah. But, you know, you just got to keep doing you. And, uh, you know what I mean? Once you keep doing you, it'll all work out. It just takes time. I love it. So what words would you give other young people that want to go the positive route and still do their thing and make it happen? I think, man, just keep God first. Keep great people around you because... You know, you actually, you, you see these people on TV, and you're like, wow, they live these edgy lifestyles, they're like so bad, boy, blah, blah, blah. But, you know, once you actually live their lifestyle, you actually see the pain they go through. And that's why you got a lot of celebrities dying from drugs and all this crazy stuff because they're depressed. The world is coming down on them. And, uh, you're, and people don't realize what a good state they're in. You know what I mean? You're living a good life, stress-free and everything. I love it. All right, so we just love us some Tashina Arnold, and we're so happy we got the pleasure to talk to her today. Thank you. Huh, girl, you wearing this purple. Oh, listen, I'm trying. Are you talking about my lips or my outfit? Your lips, your outfit. Ah, oh, both of them? Both okay. Of them. We love it. No. We love it all. So, you're hilarious. We Thank love you. you in every role that you take on. Are you excited about season two of Survivor's Remorse? I'm very excited about season two of Survivor's Remorse. I think. It's going to be a, another journey that you take. You're going to continue this journey with the, the uh, crazy Callaways. But more importantly, you're going to learn a little more about each character. We're delving a little deeper into the story. And uh, I'm, I'm really excited about what we have coming up. It's fun. It's going to be funny. It's going to be heartfelt. It's going to be a good thing. Right now, but one of the things I want to ask you is, you know, since you've been in the business for some time, I know you've seen negative media, positive media. What's your take on positivity? Do you think there's room for it in the media world? Oh, I only do positivity. Um, my, all my social media is either to you to uplift, and um, I think everything is not taken in a positive way, even though it's given in a positive way. So I'm very careful about what I post. I'm very careful about how I engage people. I'm very careful about, you know, going beyond when it's no longer funny. You know, we don't want cyberbullying. We don't want any of that. We want to uplift each other, but, you know, tell each other the truth. Have dialogue. Start conversation. You know, engage with each, each other so we can learn something. Okay. Thank you so much. All right, so I'm standing here with my boy, Ron Rico yeah, Lee. It's good to see you. Time. We're doing this again. Again. Coming like a, a recurring theme. It's routine for it. us. It's, good. Like it's it. good to see you. Yeah, it's good to be seen. Good to see you. And how's the family? Family's good, growing. Wife is pregnant. That's why she's not here. That's Number two, right? Here. Number two. Be here any day. I should probably be looking at my phone right now, like literally. Uh, you probably should. Is it a boy or girl? Another little boy. 
another little boy. So right, well, we got a lot to celebrate this time. So I'm a happy man. You should be. You should be. So we're coming back from season one yes. of Survivor's Remorse, and congratulations for making it to season Thank two. You. Thank you very much. So tell me how excited you are. What we can look forward to? Uh, I'm very excited. You know, uh, it's not easy getting from season one to season two, and when you're blessed to do it, you got to do it. And uh, I think we did it. We did it big this year. Uh, we went from six episodes to ten. Uh, we got cameos by LeBron James. We got great directors this year. Debbie Allen came to play with us. Uh, Ali Leroy, who did Everybody Hates Chris, came to play with us. We got Ken Whittingham back. Um, some great guest cast, too. We have uh, Alan Maldonado, who uh, is on Blackest and Straight Outta Compton. He's like in every movie coming out this summer. But he has a great role on the show this year. Um, and we just had a lot of fun. I think all the characters grow. Uh, love is in the air for, for, for quite a few of the characters this year. Um, what else? Um, we we want to know what you get into this season. You know, Reggie is steady trying to expand the brand. Reggie is steady trying to, to, to establish Cam's le uh, legacy. You know, he wants Cam to have that money, that long money, uh, you know, for generations to come. So uh, you'll see Reggie kind of branch off into a different business venture. Uh, you know, I'm not going to say whether it works or not, but he definitely tries to uh, try something different this season uh, with regards to his company. And, uh, and, and he brings in Cam, and so I'll let it be a surprise if how it all works out. But nonetheless, uh, no, nah, you know, Reggie is just uh, still doing Reggie, trying to keep the Callaways in line. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm so happy for him. <laughs> this is like family, y'all. Well, look, look who I have here, an old friend from the BET Awards in oh, L.A. How are you? Oh, yeah, I'm doing excellent. How you doing? I'm doing well. So you, you got a lot going on. I think when we talked a few months ago, you were telling me about all the great things that you had going yeah. straight out of Compton. Yeah. So you got that. Now you have Survivor's Remorse. Yeah. You know, your career is is going very well right now. What else can we expect from you? Wow, man. Um, we got a lot of stuff coming out. I got another show called You're the Worst coming out September 9th. Um, we got this coming out Sunday. I got uh, Blackish. I'm on Blackish as well. That comes out September 23rd. And then I have another film with uh, BET called The Startup starring me and Diggy Simmons. So, so yeah, 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 yeah. Brothers working. It's a pretty busy summer for me. I, I like to call it the summer Maldonado. So, we, you know, we, we working right now. We working, we working. Yes. One last thing we need you to do. A Sweet Kendoy TV is a positive media outlet. You know, okay. we're trying to promote positivity in media okay. and let people know that you can still be positive and, yes. and, and be cool and fun and all that yes, other stuff. Yes, so, yes. you know, what's your take? I think that, you know, being negative is a cop out. I think it's the easy way to do things and being positive is this is a harder way. So um, choose 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 to be different than the crowd. Right. It, people love negativity and people love that and it's more it's it's entertaining for those, but positivity always outshines and outlasts everything. Yo, what's up y'all? It's your boy Jacob Lattimore and this is Sweet Candor TV. Peace. As you can see, we were cutting up for the red carpet interview. So many amazing celebrities. So again, you have to go check out season two of Survivor's Remorse on Stars. Go check it out today.